Um, so yeah, we are given that this thing is an arithmetic series already. We are given which is an arithmetic series. And then they say calculate the sum of the series. What is the difference between the previous questions that we've done here? Look at this. This one didn't have an end. You look at this one, it didn't have an end. Okay? And then they were specific. Determine the sum of the first 40 terms. Like calculate up until you get to sum number 40. With this one, it has a start. It also has an end. We know what is the first term. We also know what is the last term. Now, this one here, it's TN. It's our last term. TN is also known as term, uh, the last term. Now, how many terms are here? That's the question that we should ask ourselves. How many terms are here in this in this series? We have no idea how many terms are here. We can see term number one, we can see term number two, term number three, and then we see this last term. So if they say calculate the sum of the series, what are we going to do? First, we are going to calculate the number of terms. How do you calculate the number of terms? You are going to say TN is going to be given by A plus n minus one multiplied by d, and then we looked for the general formula, which is going to say we have eighteen plus n minus one. We have n minus one multiplied by d. What is our d? Yeah, we can always calculate d. We say this one subtract this one. It gives us what six, and then we come and put six here. And after that, we multiply. This one multiplied by this one. This one multiplied by this one. It says we're 18 plus 6n minus 6, which is going to be equal to 6n, again, plus 12. But remember, this is equal to tn, again. This is equal to tn, again. And then this one is also equal to what, two? To tn. Meaning which we can then say, but now, 300 is going to be equal to... 6n plus 12. Take this one to this other side. It says you have 288, okay? which is going to be 6n. Divide by 6, divide by 6. It says n is going to be 48. So in other words, what does this mean? It means we are looking for the sum. We are looking for the sum of the first eight, uh, 48 terms. Man, what kind of a series is this one? Is it geometric or arithmetic? Arithmetic and then arithmetic, you can use the formula that says n all over two open bracket a plus the last term. How do we know the last term? What is our last term? Uh, okay, it's sn. Sorry about that. It's sn. It's sn. And then you know we're looking for s forty eight. Now where I see n, I put forty eight. Put forty eight here divided by two. First term is what? Eighteen plus three hundred. 710. What did you get? 7,622. Sure. So a question like this one is going to be four marks. Huh? Where do you get your four marks? Uh, getting the general term, getting N, substituting, and then the final answer. 